Under the Flag of the Rising Sun is a drama war film directed by Kinji Fukusaku. Now this is different from a lot of his other films because it's, it's a drama. It's not uh, like a gangster film, Yakuza film. It's not an action movie, which he's kind of known for. This one's uh, a lot different. Now, that's why I want to check it out. This one is about Saki. She is a uh, mother who is supposed to be getting some wartime benefits because her husband died during World War II. However, she gets rejected when his um, the reason for his death changes and he is um, she is disqualified for the benefits. So they, they basically tell her that her husband was killed, um, not in battle or, or valiantly, but for he was executed for running away from battle, which is a great shame on her. And she basically wants to find the truth. So she keeps visiting the office until they give her four leads to check out. Or is it five? There might have been five leads. Um, and she basically spends the movie going, visiting all these different people. And every time she visits them, she gets a little bit more of a piece of the puzzle. And it becomes a really harrowing and emotional journey. Uh, this movie is really brutal in terms of its tone and its uh, story. It's based off uh, two short stories that won an award in Japan. So it's deeply rooted in the history. But you get that really murky, gross sort of um, part of World War II, very similar to... Um, uh, there's a war film about World War II that I watched recently that was really good. Fires on the Plane, and also uh, similar to another um, murky sort of gross World War II film. I don't remember. I had it. I was I was thinking about it earlier, but basically this movie definitely does not hold back. Oh, it's Sancho the Bailiff. Very similar emotional wise but this movie just keeps going and like every time she visits a new person and gets a little bit more information you get another twist in the narrative and it just keeps getting more and more into a spiral of darkness and it's just it, it will definitely leave you like hollow this movie definitely does not try to go for uh, any particular like sort of goal but it just the journey that you take with this woman is really like really raw and 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 very vulnerable you get to see her just sort of get her, her whole world get taken apart as we find out more and more what happened in those last days of world war ii so um under the flag of the rising sun is uh it, it's not for the most faint of heart but it's a really rewarding drama film definitely one of the better um war drama films out there are definitely enjoyable well not enjoyable but you know what i mean it's 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 worth it so i give uh, under the flag of the rising sun a six and a half out of ten